One of the components which is founded in the crash cart is the sterile gloves, which we will use if there is a sterile procedure, like insertion for the central line. When we will speak about sterile gloves, we have to join this one and combine that one with the hand hygiene, which is the very basic principle of the infection control. So here we will demonstrate the hand hygiene using the hand rub and the, the soap and water. If you need to do the hand rub, you need to put sufficient amount in your hand. Actually, we followed the WHO recommendations. It will take 20 to 30 seconds to make your hand dry. Here we will demonstrate the hand washing. We will wet the hand and put sufficient amount of the soap. Now we will go to the core of this video, which is sterile gloves. After we did hand hygiene, we need to grasp the inner package and lie it on a clean, dry, flat surface or at the above waist level. Open the package, keeping the gloves on the inside surface of the rubber. Identify the right and the left gloves. Done the glove for the dominant hand first. With the thumb and the first two fingers of the non-dominant hand, grasp the gloves for the dominant hand by touching only the gloves inside folded surface. Carefully pull the glove over the dominant hand, leaving it uncuffed, and ensure that the cuff does not up the wrist. Ensure that the thumb and fingers are in the proper spaces. Slip fingers of the glove dominant hand inside the second glove's cuff. Do not allow fingers and thumb of the gloves dominant hand to touch any part of the exposed non-dominant hand, keeping the thumb of the dominant hand abducted. Carefully pull the second glove over the non-dominant hand. After doing the second glove, interlock the fingers of the hand, touch only the sterile area of the gloves. Doffing the sterile gloves, there is actually two techniques to remove the uh, gloves. Let's see them. The main important point actually is to touch only the outside of the gloves and do not touch the skin. Hope you find this video useful. Thank you so much.